what is going on guys it is your boy fly stewie back in a, another one today we're showing you off can the terminator still win in season 19 even with the debuffs if you like videos like this and you want to see more make sure you hit that subscribe button the notification bell the like because that of course is what makes us grow guys it really helps in the algorithm so what team do we have today guys we have a beautiful team we have our yam plant in the front of course gives them poison damage we have our backdoor poison garish aqua and we have our termi dust termi 46 speed lots of health in the back so the main thing i want to talk about guys is with the nerfs as you know garish worm 10 damage reduction 10 shield reduction in the back chomp damage reduction lagging damage reduction allergic damage reduction and of course the critical reduction and here this is basically the same yam got a little bit of reduction but we don't really care about yams attack bonuses anyway so with that being said guys we are going to see if this team has what it takes to still be dominant this season so i haven't played with this team in a while but i think they can still be good i know a bunch of my scholars use it and they've been relatively decent so far but we're gonna see if so i almost want to ah i kind of want to wait i kind of want to man all right we're gonna skip this round having the aquas first is always interesting i feel like <laughs> I feel like the reason you do that is because you've just seen too much. You've taken too much L's in a row. He's gonna definitely gonna go for an energy steal or something here. Oh my god, wow. Thank god we survived that. And then we get lucky. Hey man, sometimes you want luck more than skill. I'm gonna keep it real. <laughs> sometimes that's what you want in life. You want luck more than skill, okay? Okay, we really need these poison ticks for endgame, so we're gonna just give him the absolute business in the back here. Oh my god, the prickling trap on the aqua is just so powerful. It almost makes me not want to use my aqua anymore. Okay, can I survive this? That's the real dilemma. Oh no, oh no, he gets me out of here. Oh no! Yeah, I should have known. Okay, one on three. Let's see if I got this skill still. Wow. I think he skips here. Okay, so we probably want to put as much defense as we can up. As possible. Okay, so we're still good here. He guesses completely when I'm going to use my... <laughs> he guesses completely when I was going to use my thing. That's fine. So now we got the one-on-one. -on -one. Remember, this is one-on-three. Oh, three. Oh, my God. Okay, so the, the bad news for me is he has a bunch of energy now. Ooh, not much we can do here, guys, honestly. Just too much energy. Too much ways to gain energy. I can't skip. Huh. 
I almost want to like just go for a crit here, right? So I mean, we can we can try. <laughs> like we can try our best here, but I don't know I don't know what to do against a team like this. He definitely saw the chomp coming. And look at that, the double prickling. Flystu, you said a gift, early gift. I'm sad. I want some teams. Yandu said, I see a scholars are lucky having a strong team and a kind manager. Oh, so that's how it works. By the way, I've already have experience with APP and ABP for only two weeks because that wasn't mine. Oh yeah, definitely having experience with the teams is huge. So the first game was a loss. We could have probably won that, honestly. I'm just a little rusty with this team. So let's go for a steal in the front. This is pretty scary on the front axi, honestly. It makes you make sure that you have to get rid of him. No lolly yagging. Interesting axi. <laughs> so I, I I never know what to prioritize when I go against these teams. Should I, you prioritize the back, the front? Like I like this matchup against my um energy destroyed. Okay, does he get rid of me in one hit? Oh, he does. I think. No, we survive. Let's go. We survive. We're in this. <laughs> the really friendly crits. Two crits. The same game. You gotta love it. All right, let's do something like this, guys. And we're gonna play bully. Oh, what the heck? What was that? Mary Lynn? Oh my god, did you see all of that shield? Guys, that was insane. That was insane. I've never seen that before on a beast. Wow. This is a 160 card, guys. 160, one of the rare 160 cards. Apply 20% shield when played in the chain. Oh my goodness. She got that, she got that, she got that million dollars. <laughs> Cole Hart said nice crit. Hey man, sometimes you gotta pray to crit Jesus. I pray to him 10 times a day, every day. I just wanna give him one poison. I don't think he has enough to kill me in one shot, but he might, honestly. He might. Kazer with the sub! Chaser, I appreciate it. Hopefully I can get this W for you. Oh, he lets me hit him? Okay. Okay, I'm fine with that. All right, so we're just gonna skip here. We're gonna let him do his dirtiness. I think he wanted me to get him under 50% so he could angry land me to oblivion, but we just wanted to give him one poison, that's all. <laughs> Jaden says, I think he surrendered. Kazer, man, I really appreciate that. My dude. Can this guy put up shield? I guess he can kind of put up shield too. I don't think, I think he can do a lot of things. I don't think he can do anything about this. Like, he just don't got enough juice. And then look at this. Ah, uh, oh, I. <laughs> okay, I was about to say. I know I poisoned them. There's no way this guy's not poisoned. And this is what makes this team so strong, guys. And right, just like that, get him with a double chomp, a Stewie special. Send this guy to the Shadow Realm, heart of the cards. Don't fail me now. Hey, we're about to tuck this boy into bed. It's your boy, Fly Stewie. It's Fly Stewie. Baby, come.
Come on, man. The dust termy is not to be played with. Gotta love it, guys. All right, so with that win being said, we are going to, Frolin says nice G, Koki says GG, Yande says, man, I got, he got comfortable on that play. Oh, he got way too comfortable. He did not expect me to put up that much shields. So this team, even though it got nerfed, it's very effective against a lot of builds, which is why I'm still breeding it as our main team, but I am trying out a bunch of other teams to see what is successful, guys. But as I said, we're gonna invite Scholar Lucky number 13. Um, I think we're gonna go to the Discord here. Let's get some jazz on. So as you guys know today, there's a bunch of ways to go through, of course, the application process. Um, right here, you go through it. Let's go to how to become a scholar. I lay it out very simply here. We're at 326 in the Discord. The most active members get it. Of course, they get first pick. If you rock out on Twitch stream, it shows me their watch time. You get second pick and first pick. And of course, make sure that you go to the read first under the scholarship section and fill out a scholarship. Now, what I normally do in my scholarships when I'm giving away, I give one to an experienced person that's been with the flight that has a lot of gaming experience. I give one to someone who that's just been rocking out with us um, for a long time. And I give one person to someone new, to someone we've just started talking to, who's someone who's you know basically very new to the community, um, whether it's the day of the stream or I've just known them for a week. That way, I think it makes it exciting for the new watchers, the old watchers, and you know we get a lot of experienced person. So when we go to our scholar applications here, and we go read all of them, um, a lot of applications stood out to me. This person, I think has just came through. Um, this person I think has just came through and I liked their application. I really liked it. It has to be none other than, drum roll please. Wait, hold up, hold up. We gotta, we gotta make it more exciting than that. We have to, we have to really, you know, get, get it out here, you know, really make sure that the anticipation is built up. <laughs> Come on, man. I, got, I gotta make it a little more. Congrats. Let's see this. So if you guys haven't already, make sure that you join that Discord. Of course, that is where all of the magic happens. Okay. So I think I'm ready for this. What about you? You super fly, baby. Yeah, it's Congratulations it's to Scholar number yeah. 13. Adrian, Marcel, you are super fly baby now one of the things that adrian really did to stand out is he was all about the leadership roles he really came through he wanted that leadership he's all about that um and he had great experience in the game so congratulations to adrian he's gonna get the experienced new scholar spot i think it's well deserved um he's been absolutely phenomenal in the community so big congratulations to him the next two scholars i'm gonna give out one is to someone who's been with the flight crew for a long time and the one after that is gonna be someone completely new guys that's you know has just basically joined very shortly um so guys big congrats to adrian i hope you enjoy your jumping garish dust terminator team and welcome to the flight crew guys guys if you like videos like this and you want to see more and you want to see why the dust terminator still is really powerful within this meta make sure you hit that like button you hit that follow button you hit that subscribe button and let me know which team you think is going to dominate the meta it's been your boy fly stewie and we gotta get out of here Peace.